words for synonyms were bar structure and intelligence is minimum i don't even like rap i see hate and hiding i don't listen to this shit i like creative writing i'm like a ray that's lighting up the way when they are fighting with the whole array of lightning till they roll away and lighten my gravitational pull will cause solar flares originated in the north call me a polar bear i'm an athlete i'm a track star actually running rapidly insanity's a fast part living in vanity pamper me'll be struck down if they ain't I'm detecting the best is yet to fester. Yes, the incredible professional pen wrestler. I'm the one. Welcome to Revamp Wrestling. Subscribe to channel and smash the like button. Sonya's tenacity in the ring is to match it. You have to have that killer instinct when you're dealing with her. If you pull any punches, she'll run right over you. That power bomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Ronnie Hurry Karata. Showing off the quickness. That'll turn. No! The dive! Throwing all costs into the wind and leaping to the outside. She's starting to look concerned. Here, unleashing that killer instinct, matching Sonya's tenacity. This is how you deal with the villain. And they just got back in. Sonya the Bill connected with a solid shot. And stomping away in the corner. 
Oh, she has bad intentions now. Removing the turnbuckle pad. Yeah. Gonna step up in Zagari. Right in the ear. Look at this. DDT on the foot. Into the armbar. Left arm trap wiggles free. Nicely done. Into the corner. This can't be good. Oh, kicks. That was a vicious display. You can almost see the disdain in their eyes. Just ruthless. Look, the most intelligent competitor in a battle knows that there are many roads to victory, including the low road. Gavale looking for the high risk move. Up high, Tommy Cross body! Throwing all costs into the win. Two! Fends off the three count. This could be a tipping point in this match. She's got to be careful here. The referee will count her out. Big forearm. Sonya Deville rolls through into the triangle armbar. Got to pass the arm. The Trying to free herself from the triangle. Left hands fighting desperately, and she's free. <laughs> was over. Inverted face lock into an elbow drop. DeVille on the verge here. Makes a cover. And Sonya DeVille wins. Here is your winner, Sonya DeVille. Sonya DeVille getting what she wants and the win. This win just proved that when DeVille sets her focus, she gets what she wants. oddballs, but they're legit. I wouldn't be surprised if they're really an accredited academy. They're highly trained, highly intelligent, and highly competitive. They certainly think so.
Well, you know, this ominous tune is just a prelude to the toll of man. A competitor with seemingly no weaknesses, no fears. And here he is, Karrion Cross. to fall and pray. to win this match by nearly crippling their competition. Bingo, right you are, Saxton, doing whatever it takes to capture the win and teaching their opponent a little bit about pain in the process. That is good wrestling. situation ahead for this guy, but he is more than ready for it. We are about to see something good. see. It's one that the WWE Universe has wanted to see. It's one that I've been waiting to see, and it's about to go down. And here we go. A lot of superstars involved in this matchup. Each team is going to look for their competition's weakness. The weakest link on a team will certainly be exposed. A team would be smart to identify their own weaknesses and keep that superstar out of the fight. Slam. Trap in the arms. Oh, what blows. Good grief, man. This is vicious. And with an onslaught of strikes like that, it's clear they have nothing but punishment on their mind. And he had Carrion's number there. Rolling elbow finds its mark. Ouch. Come down and 
it sure as hell did right there. Stomping down. Knowing how big all six of these men's egos can be, they might struggle to stay on the same page in this matchup, which is why the success of either team is most likely going to boil down to deferring to better a quick cover. He hasn't done nearly enough to get the pin yet. He's really trying to rush this match. Targeted stop to the arm. Comes in off the tag. Akira was on the wrong end of things here. If he's smart, he'll make a tag soon. A break on the apron could help him mitigate this damage. To the jaw. Shot to the gut. Wide with the insecurity, but from behind. With the and will this be it? Then he gets the shoulder up before two. Staying in this one. Lands in the drop zone. There he goes, right into the corner. Forearm. Oh dear, this doesn't look good. Ouch! That's one way to get your opponent out of the corner. The power of Tazawa showing here. And Tazawa might have more in store. Crafty way to get out of harm there. Dangerous position here, guys. Oh, no, 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 Back no. suplex. Nasty. The hardest part of the ring. That was worse than being hit by a cinder block. A nice shot by Otis. <laughs> Hoist it up. Caving in the abdomen. Raped across the top rope. Clubbing forearm. Oh, direct impact to the chest. Tossing their opponent like they're nothing. It might not be flashy, but sometimes you just gotta toss another person and make a statement. Came down like a lead balloon. Placing them right where they want them, into the corner. same page they were on the same sentence with that fine piece of work tag is made and here we go <laughs> control on a suplex i'll just leave it at this nobody comes into a match hoping to get chucked around like that Big buzz. and carrion cross is all business now It was being held back with each of those strikes. Ooh, power He's in a little bit of trouble now. It's important to stay calm in a situation like this. Yeah, you're taking some hits, but there's a lot of time left to go. Fresh man in. Oh, yeah, here we go. Swinging away from Otis. Otis is running to a roadblock. And this might not have a pleasant ending. Oh, snake eyes caving in their face. Elena's aggression, just oh. pure brutality. Come on, easy. He went right into that turnbuckle. Dragon screw takedown, not finished yet. Expertly applied leg lock. And cross cover here. He stops the count for his partner. Trap in the arms. Oh, what blows to the back of the neck. Carry and cross. Cross with the doomsday Saito. This is chaotic. Come on, rep. 
He gets tagged in. Great strength being shown here. Put down face first. Things are getting risky. This will not end well. Back suplex on the apron. Count Cole. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Oh man, by the skin of his teeth. Jeez, what a way to make us sweat. Ooh, bang! Look at this heel hook. This is how you punish your opponent, and he's enjoying every minute of it. Now he's been put on the defensive. A very aggressive cross on the attack. Just deadlifting their opponent and tossing them aside. And this is gonna be it. He kicks out in two. Both competitors digging deep into their well to keep this match going. Four and just raking across the face. Otis with the reversal. was just a step slow. Placed into the corner. Uh-oh. Face first. Uh-oh. Left at him. Going corner to corner. And they're not finished yet. Spine first again. This is a show of confidence or a wasted opportunity to attack your opponent. Face Buster Blanson. Look at this raw power. It's a sham powerbomb. Thunderous impact. Dominating shoulder tackle. Just a straight deadlift the power into a dominator. Tagging his partner in now. Uncorked a big punch. Look at a little out of it up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this could very well be the beginning of the end. Awesome. All the way to the outside. Uh-oh. Hazardous plots out here on the apron. A back He had it 
gets scouted. Oh, man, check out this power. Gorilla press slam. And crosses path to destruction. Gets put on hold there. Boom, what a punch. This is close line. So much momentum. He's taking a moment to feel the crowd, but he better focus on the opposition. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Tag made. Tag made. Like a brick wall. Here he goes for the win. And he closes it out. And only gets a one count. Wow. Tough position to be caught in here. Gonna be bad. It's gonna be really bad. Oh my goodness! Oh, I think we're gonna see it. Uh oh! How's that for a count? Now oh, pull the hair and turn it into a max slam. We have seen these men unleash a lot of devastating offense. Incredible that this match hasn't ended yet. It might just be a matter of time. This one is close to coming to a head. There's a tag. Shows that this is still anybody's match at this point. Oh, 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 for the bionic elbow. Oh, wicked kick to the lower back. Hold on. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, solid kick across the back. He was elusive there. He got whipped into that corner. That's the good stuff, yeah! Shoulder block over and over in the corner. And a club to the back. Clean tag for his partner. <laughs> oh, I think we're going to see it. <laughs> One right hand, another and another. Provided escape plan. First one. Oh, my goodness, what a cold red. Hoping to end it here. This is it. And he stops the count for his partner. That could dislocate your shoulder. Tackles ruthless. We might be close to the end. Yeah, this match has not been kind to him. Lands the knee. Looks like Carrion's feeling it. Tag is made, and he's coming in hot. Running Hurricane Rana! Fantastic. Akira Tozawa planted one there. Laser precision. Corey, that was a shiny wizard. <laughs> Listen to this place. It's electric. And this match is about to fade to black. Saves his partner there, man. That was in tight. There's the tag. Akira now is being sized up. He's got Tozawa here. Oh, Tozawa looks out of it. And there's the save. Let's keep fighting. Wasting absolutely no respect on his opponent. You gotta love it. 
look at this. Just what a barrage of stops. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. From the top, diving clothesline finds the mark. He is a sight to behold. Take a picture while you can, everyone. Look at this, just punishing the knee. Shot after shot after shot. Hammer it away. Zyra wars that attack off. Lined him up. Oh, and a forearm. Oof, and all the impact brought to the knee. Lifts their opponent's oh, legs. Oh, it's just oh. an alley -oop. oh, God, that hurt. Just I was looking to leap off the top rope. From the top. Jarring impact. It's impossible to keep up with Tozawa. Yeah, Akira Tozawa is executing his game plan. Dominating shoulder tackle. These superstars have toiled away endlessly, and this crowd is on their feet in full appreciation. An incredible sight to see. And set right into the corner. Raw tag made. Oh, and a kick. Right to the midsection. Set him up. Russian leg sweep. He's going for the pin. This could be it. An exhausting match, but a victory he'll savor forever. Here are your winners. Nice teamwork by these three to pick up the win. Yep, that's what we call a good day at the office. Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe.
in their veins is Sheamus. This man is completely full of spit and vinegar. But as much of a brawler as Sheamus is, he's a very underrated technician. And he has the accolades and the achievements to prove that. If there's one thing that's for sure about Sheamus, it's that he delivers banger after banger. We're about to see how he fares against Big Bronson Reed. Because it's nothing personal. Destroying the competition is just the business Reed is in. Debilitating attack on the leg. Cravat locked in. Hip breaker! And his eyes are piercing through the opposition now. What a shoulder block. Completely flattened, and that should do it. That has to do it. According to know Sheamus loves a methodical style. If there's one thing Sheamus can do, it's brawl. The Celtic Warriors more than happy to oblige going toe-to-toe -to -toe with anyone to turn their body into a heavy bag. Stay in this match. Stiff headbutt. In full control here, face first. Ooh, that's how you dominate your opponent. Just a perfect mix of pure power and bad intentions. Oh, I saw it coming. He steps foot in the ring again. Oh, what a right hook. Front face lock applied. It's about to get more painful. Top oh, a suplex. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. Here we go. Unbelievable athleticism. Just going for it all and landing a direct hit. Crushing knee strike. He's got him down. Is this it? Rope break. Pin stops. This is getting intense. Someone check on Saxton. Vicious right forearm. Into the corner now. Boom. This is just establishing dominance, followed by a stop. Sheamus with the Iris. Coast. I don't think Sheamus is done by her. Curse backbreakers. Sheamus, that might be it. He narrowly avoids the count. He got close there. It could be do or die time. And Sheamus, uh oh. He's got him scouted. Just punched him right in the mouth. Nicely done. Carefully placed stomp to the arm. He's on his heels a bit now. Sheamus came looking for a fight, and this is clearly just what happens when he finds a fight. Got him set up in the corner of the ring. Solely focused on ooh, wrestling 101. If you can't stand, you can't fight. Oh, using your head to counter that. Wasteland into a set. Can he score the pin? Pushes through after two. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Will this... 
Now the backbreaker. This is excruciating. Oh, what an escape. And Reed grabs the W here in this one. Sheamus can't be happy with this outcome. This is going to be eating at him for a while. Here he is. Behold the Punisher. Damian Priest on a mission to destroy. The following is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. Representing the Judgment Day. From New York City. Weighing in at 249 pounds. Damian. Damian Priest is dead set on growing his legacy, on bringing more and more glory to his name. And he's done just that, Cole. A modern-day bad guy picking fights and winning gold. But it's never enough for the power-hungry Damian Priest. The monster of all monsters has arrived. And his opponent from Shiro's Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds. Strowman! Terrifying power with unmatched brutality. And ever since his return, Strowman has been on a path of destruction. Embodies no mercy, no remorse. He's a sadistic individual. So you need tenacity just to survive the man. Something I've noticed about Damian Priest is how he approaches every match with the same cold confidence. Nothing shakes him from his dark purpose of eliminating any and all opposition. Yeah, it's a grim determination that drives Priest in the ring. And if I'm being completely honest, it's kind of chilling how nothing seems to break his focus. Yeah, I have to agree with you. Priest's unflinching nature is a little disturbing. But let's not forget about the path of destruction that Braun Strowman leaves in his wake every time he enters the ring. Nay, every time he enters the arena. Yeah, Strowman only has one thing on his mind at any given moment, and that is destroying anyone who sets foot in his path. And now thrown back into the ring.
He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Up high, cross body. So cover, cover. Kicks out at just one. Close call, but not enough yet. Braun Strowman seems to always come to the ring with pure malice in his eyes. Does that incredible fury give him an edge in this matchup? It absolutely can. That bloodlust can drive. Damian Priest. Good block there. South of heaven. Serious jeopardy for Strowman. I think the fuse has been lit here, guys. Hard-fought victory, incredibly physical matchup, but this man has earned the right to celebrate here tonight. Wait, this is more fun than celebration. Oh, this from behind. More fun. This is classless. Why is he doing this? Now into the steel steps. Come on. Bringing you videos on all wrestling, reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. The Judgment Day is here. Everyone in their way is doomed. The following contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, accompanied by Dominic Mysterio at a combined weight of 370 pounds. The World Tag Team Champions, Finn Balor and J.D. McDonough. The Judgment Day growing more dominant every single night, and their accolades grow with every match. Now, this is a group that's almost impossible to prepare for. The Judgment Day plans for every scenario, always having each other's back. So they create chaos. Judgment Day thrives in chaos. The Judgment Day almost creative in their physicality. They take pleasure in it, Michael. I hope medical is standing by for this one. Well, the Judgment Day, quite simply, will do anything to win. Well, there's competition, Corey, and then there's what Judgment Day is willing to resort to. Get ready for a new normal. And their opponents, first from Franklinville, New Jersey, Weighing in at 249 pounds, Joe Gacy. A man already well known for his mind games. You cannot discount the power and speed of Gacy either. You know, I've heard Gacy preach backstage, and I gotta say, he seems pretty insufferable. Well, Byron, what you call insufferable. Well, many of his followers call scripture. And Gacy is all about accumulating followers, accumulating power.
Can you gentlemen feel that? Something truly dangerous is upon us. Yeah, I feel something all right. Actually, I see something straight out of a nightmare. We know so little about this individual. You're right, Cole, and whatever you can imagine, it's probably worse. This man has such a... Haunting laugh. Seems like Uncle Howdy finds some sort of sick amusement in the pain and confusion of others. I'd venture to say uh, Uncle Howdy is one of the more disturbing superstars we've ever witnessed. had questions for months about Uncle Howdy. I wonder if we're finally about to get some answers. Well, we're about to find out if he's as frightening in the ring as he is on screen. Here we go with the Judgment Day in the ring. This group causes chaos and destruction wherever they go, all in the pursuit of amassing as much power as they can. Judgment Day is a legitimate threat to anyone in WWE. They have the numbers, the talent, and they will smash any superstar in their way. Yeah, Judgment Day won't rest until there's nobody left to oppose them, until they have completely taken over WWE. And as their opponents, you need to cut the ring in half. You're facing a team with great synergy. Keeping them apart will be essential to success. Isolation is certainly a key to neutralizing any great tag team. We are European uppercut. Kicks to the face. Hand off with a big one. Every strike more devastating than the last. When you have the skill, you flaunt it and you make it hurt too. He's lining him up. To the sky. Close line. Here he comes off the tag. Oh, kick right to the gut! Looks like Gacy's match definitely isn't gaining a new follower in this one. Balor really sent a message there. Oh! Somersault plunge out of the floor. Soaring out of the ring, looking to do as much damage as possible. Oh! Balor setting up! Superstars that go great together, and that win is proof. Another battle, another immense display of power to shut up the non believers.
Revamp Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, the recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, Monday, and subscribe. Night Raw. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Kansas City, weighing in at 285 pounds, Baron Corbin! If you ask Baron Corbin, he will tell you that he is the epitome of what being a WWE superstar is all about. Ready to take what's his. Baron Corbin is ready to go. And believe me, Corbin has zero concern about the wreckage and collateral damage. Main event, Jey Uso. Yeah, it's just him, Uso. changed about Jey Uso is his unrelenting desire to be at the top of WWE. Yeah, and at this point, I don't think anything can hold him back. Jey Uso has... ready to deliver on his unbelievable hype. With Jey Uso, you have to remember, we're looking at a tag team specialist who's really made a name for himself as a singles competitor as a player. Defying his family's wishes, carving out a path for himself as just Jey. He has truly been a delight to watch grow as a competitor these days. And he's got quite the challenge in front of him as he's facing a newly refreshed Baron Corbin. We've seen Corbin go through a lot of changes and phases here in WWE, but we're finally seeing his truest self shine through. And that true self is dangerous as hell. We see the look in Baron Corbin's eyes based on how well you know Corbin. What can we expect to see from him in this battle? These two are clearly fired up going blow for blow. Two Titans trading strikes and refusing to back down. Toe-to-toe, -to -toe, treating each other like heavy bags. What impressive determination for both competitors. Keeping at each other no matter what. That's right, put your ones up in the air for main event Jey Uso. Whoa. Taking a trip outside, but he's got to be mindful of the count. Oh. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Looking for a belly to back suplex into the neck breaker. Beautiful. I think Jay's making a great addition to this family's legacy with that kind of brutal impact. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. He could pin his opponent right here. It's over. No, stops the count at two. He just won't give up. 
Something of a competitive edge has been brewing between these superstars lately. A drive to prove who really has the upper hand here. Yeah, competition can really bring out the best of people, and I think we will be seeing that from them here in the NBA. Superstar realizes how oh, oh, come on. Seconds. I understand being frustrated, but that's ridiculous. This superstar just crossed the line. Now, such an impressive resume for Rhea Ripley. But man, is she intimidating. Yeah, it's no easy task to face down Rhea Ripley. Always ready to eradicate any obstacle in her way. for the nightmare to begin. And from Sioux City, Iowa, Kaiva This is a match that folks have been clamoring for, and they are excited to finally get it. I'm looking at her right now, and I'm watching her body language, and her intimidation factor has got to be off the charts knowing she's facing Rhea Ripley. Her intimidation factor is zero. With this 
match underway, it's worth noting that she's made clear that this is a must-win match in terms of cover. She kicks out at one. A truly impressive kick out this late. Tackle. Uh, that hurt. No respect at all with that action. But it can also be meant to antagonize. Could be a method of luring your opponent into a mistake. That's present. Added damage. You can see that each strike drained their opponent's energy. Ooh, that'll mess up your shoulder. Worse for wear in the corner now. Kick to the gut. Ooh, that's a kick that would leave you gasping for air. And will this be it? One, and she kicks at it too. She's still as determined as ever. Big forearm. Oh, what a clubbing blow. Oh, no. Oh, no. This could end it all. Alabama slam! Face first. Looking bad for her here. Seeing some no-nonsense offense from Rhea. No secret that Rhea Ripley possesses terrifying strength. Does that give her an upper hand tonight? Absolutely. Rhea's ability to overpower the competition, throw them around the ring, gives her an instant advantage. If she can get control over her opponent, this could be a quick match. Just going all out with every blow. Ripley gets her back. Oh, Northern Lights! Oh, yeah, they're done. The Roundhouse connects. Focused attack on the leg. And again in the other direction. Two-handed choke slam! She's losing some steam now. Here we go. If that attack didn't already make it clear, Ripley's doing whatever it takes to get the win tonight. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. Denied via a wicked punch. Uh-oh, we know what's next. Set up powerball. Wow, just as effective as her opponent. Oh, she's removing the turnbuckle pad. Come on, this isn't right. Oh, using the knee. Oh, man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, my goodness. Ah, oh, what a smash. That is just insulting. Nasty stops. Oh, that could have done some serious damage. Attack after attack is smothering Rhea. Can Ripley recover from this adversity? Attack after attack on target. Oh, trapping the arm. Oh, Rhea went down in a heap. After a kick out like that, you have to be impressed by Rhea Ripley. And now it's reload time. Time to find another moment to pull out that one more time. Uses the edge of the knee. A constant assault from her here. Momentum has clearly swung her way. She's getting back up, but she might be down again soon. From way up, and able to counter. Rhea isn't taking this lying down anymore. But Ripley still has to do more to get this fully in her favor. To the leg. Oh, snapping the leg and bang! Face, my God! Wrist clutch applied. 
And now a series of stomps and kicks. Yeah. Pushing them aside. Momentum clearly on the side of Ripley. Rhea is putting that terrifying strength to work, fighting hard to get control over her opponent.
Undertaker is deaf. He's got him covered. And he kicks out. He just powered out there, Cole. Orton with a Fez press, raining down right hands. Just never had a chance to block any of those. Dropping the elbow right on the knee. He heads outside, countouts legal in this match. Ooh. Oh, God. Had that one scouted. Orton hooking his opponent, and ooh, nasty backbreaker. Oh, ouch. Measuring. Oh, face stop. And that can end up putting CM Punk on shaky legs for a bit. Yeah, but he's not breathing heavy yet. Slam by Orton. Momentum is running away from Punk. And Randy Orton is on a roll here. Randy Orton's such an intelligent competitor. For as much as he's seen and done in this business, it really makes game planning against him difficult. Yeah, and to your point, Cole, Orton likes to capitalize on his opponent's missteps, so you can't play into his hand. He waits for you to make mistakes, so, you know, don't. Target. Able to parry that one. Oh my God, direct in there. He's got him down. Is this it? And he manages to kick out in one. An emphatic kick out, and there's still a lot of game left here. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Up high. Cross body from the top. Strong counter from Punk. CM Punk doing what he can to halter the beatdown. Maybe Punk's found a new source of aggression to battle back with. Oh, what a kick. Springboard! Come on! Oh, Orton with a fence pressed and now unloading rights on his opponent. And any one of those shots could take you out for good. Oh, a nasty stop to finish it off. Out of the ring. What's his plan here? He's expressing pain now. Yeah, not looking good at all. Toss back into the ring. Picked oh. up, back, drop, suplex. The Vipers lined up his prey. We know what's next. It, but the resilient CM Punk refused to stay down. That should have been it. 99% of the time it is. Orton is seeing red right now. And he's got more work to do here. Oh, look at this. Just crank in the head. That's got to hurt. Crank in the head. I don't know if Punk can withstand much more of this. This devastating offense from Orton is so hard to prepare for. Wearing down the knee and an elbow. How many times have we seen Orton punish his opponent? That 
after that move, Orton can see the victory in his mind. I don't think you can ever know what's real. A triumphant showing for Randy Orton. Yeah, you can sense the aggravation in CM Punk. He thought he had this one. Revamp Wrestling, bringing you videos on all wrestling reviews, recaps, and music video simulations. Like, comment, and subscribe. Here's someone who always has a plan and always knows who he's dealing with. It's Seth freaking Rollins. Think of everything Seth Rollins has been through. Everything he's accomplished, he can adapt to any situation. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Davenport, Iowa, weighing in at 217 pounds. Seth Freaking Rollins! Seth Rollins is one of the elite superstars in WWE, and the list of competitors he's put down reads like a who's who of future Hall of Famers. If we know one thing about the visionary, it's that he's always down for some action. Rollins doesn't take a back seat to anyone. Rollins enters the ring like a principal conductor about to lead an orchestra. And just like he controls this crowd, Rollins knows exactly what he's doing and can play his opponents like a finely tuned instrument. summons the support of the WWE Universe into battle. between Drew McIntyre and his goals. Whether the WWE Universe supports him or not, Drew will stay on the top of the food chain in WWE. Drew McIntyre has an unparalleled focus, refuses to let the outside noise get to him. Yeah, as clear-headed as a superstar can be, which only makes him even more dangerous. Seth Rollins set for action. I think it's fair to say that Rollins is as impressive and talented as they come when the bell rings, but he can be a bit abrasive. We'll say less about the visionary, Cole. One man's abrasive is another man's unorthodox. Seth is playing four-dimensional chess. He's an in-ring... ...mastermind. I'm actually more of a checkers guy, but no one is denying Rollins' talent. But you can't risk underestimating an opponent like Drew McIntyre. He's a truly ferocious competitor. Launching. I am able to counter. He got 
whipped into that corner. Into the cover. And there's the kick out. I didn't think this match was close to over. Long fall and even harder impact. Looks like they want to take things outside. No telling what they have in store now. Run out of ringside and back to the mat. tricky adversary for a lot of superstars. How can Drew get the better of him? The key for Drew tonight is to get Seth cornered and just unload with his full offensive might. Drew can't waste time trying to keep up with Seth's agility or getting more than one of coming tricks. You have to imagine the disdain it takes to repeatedly stop someone like that. McIntyre gets met with a response. Put the elbow counters out. Up and down, like being manhandled by a bear. McIntyre looking highly motivated right now. He turns it around. Vicious right forearm. Single underhook. Face buster. Getting set up for something in the corner. Oh, elbow caught him right on the bridge of the nose. No, no, no. Barrel, toe play, what? That's playing fast and loose with your own body. That is weaponizing your body. That's what that was. Double on your legendary pedigree. A visionary man doing visionary things. Oh, man. He didn't need that eyebrow anyway. And he gets set back into the ring. Oh, close line. Hoist it up. Good buster. Big forearm. Seth Rollins hooking his opponent. A small package driver. Can buy Drew time. Down with a power bomb. Is it enough? The cover. I don't know what more this superstar can do to put him away. Torturous focus on the leg in the corner. Rose line hits its mark. And Rollins getting battered there. Yeah, McIntyre putting as much power as he can behind his offense. Oh. Straight to the knee. Level fortitude from Rollins. And where McIntyre goes from here is unknown. Drew's accustomed to putting out so many men with that maneuver. An agile escape. McIntyre just so dominant. Yeah, Drew knows he can't give Rollins a chance to turn the tables. Oh, 
That was just malicious. Insulting. to eradicate complacency has continued by running through Seth Rollins. down. Gunther is always ready to demolish anyone who dares come in his path. And if you don't respect him, he'll make sure that you fear him. It is the ring general's battlefield, and he is ready to conquer. A true alpha male. Braun Breaker ready to dominate. And his opponents first from Woodstock, Georgia, weighing in at 230 pounds. Braun Breaker. We've seen a fury to Braun Breaker, a fiery temper that fuels him in the ring. And that fire cannot be extinguished. seems destined for very big things. I 
don't know about you guys, but I feel a sudden chill in the air. Well, Dexter Loomis has arrived. And from Recluse, Wyoming, weighing in at 230 pounds, Dexter Loomis! Just the absolute nothingness when you look into Dexter's eyes, it's horrifying. There are sinister plans at work in this man's head right now. The eyes of an artist who will paint a picture of his victims before their match. Competitors dread seeing their image painted by Loomis. I wasn't going to say anything, but Loomis painted Saxton earlier today. He did? Wait, can I at least keep the painting? Sure, if you survive. Three of WWE's top competitors ready for this triple threat match. All set for action in this one. Oh, no, he could be caught here. Bad spot for him. Gunther who And breaks the hole, but damage has been done. Placed in the corner. Wicked clothesline. Gunther. This is right for him. Looking for more damage here. Release back suplex. Ouch. I've seen Saxon thrown out of a few local bars like that before. Oh, please don't remind me, Corey. Oh, stiff punch. Suplex. Here it comes. Nicely done. As impressive as that was, it has to take something out of a solo competitor. Oh, what a close line. you want to be in right now. Oh, right to, right to right. There's definitely an elevated sense of pressure in a triple threat match. Yeah, that's because it's really your match to lose. You don't have to be pinned to lose this one. The pendulum is swinging faster with each passing second. Neckbreaker! Ouch! Let's lighten up the chest. Right to the kidneys from behind. In the corner he goes, a perfectly placed target. It goes without saying that there is a certain disdain for your opponent when you pull off something like that. Uh-oh, he turns it around on Loomis. Held in a perilous position. Straight up back down the throat. Dominating shoulder tackle. Big four. Dexter Loomis fears no man. Here's the pump handle. Suplex launched. A big punch. Ouch. Waist lock applied in the corner. Check out this power. Grabbing a kendo stick. Any connection with flesh will definitely leave a rut. And this could be it. Cover. And he breaks up the pin, and the match continues. Bullseye. And Breaker didn't exactly look like his usual powerhouse self there. Tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. Fishing for something, but this is up there. Edward it. Lewis looks out of it. Big hammer connects. Punch lands. Now oh, working on the arm. This 
vicious right forearm. in memory. This was an unpredictable one, but when it was all said and done, only one man could be left standing. One man out of three. It was always bound to lead to a little chaos. Zelina is sitting under the learning tree of Rey Mysterio and the rest of the LWO. Zelina really has a chance to break out even further. Zelina looking to make the LWO and her family proud tonight. a true fan favorite from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, the WWE Women's World Champion, Liv Morgan. Guys, Liv Morgan just living out her dream here in WWE. Yeah, Liv's career has just really taken off. Became this money in the bank and then successfully cashed in the contract to become SmackDown Women's Champion. really come into her own as of late as she's embraced her heritage and her culture as part of her identity as a WWE superstar. Quick pin attempt here. Elevates the shoulder. Premature to try to end things now. And targeting the leg there. Right to the leg. Got the leg and elbow drop. I assure you that wasn't part of Zelina's usual cold and calculated strategy. Yeah, scrappy Liv Morgan coming through there. Oh man, right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. Oh, right on the arm. Not good. Put it in the corner now. That was just malicious. Just disrespectful. Liv is losing any kind of advantage here. Yeah, Liv's defensive instincts need to kick in. A lot of intangibles in Liv Morgan. Do you think that will be the key to victory for her, Corey? Absolutely. Liv lost a lot before she won. That gave her a ton of instinct and grit. She's been in the trenches, and she's as resilient as they come. A lot of times, that's what puts you over the top. 
Ooh, dropped right on their face. And Liv should have watched out for that attack. She's not smiling now. Yeah, that ruthless streak of Zelina's peeking out right there. into the ring from the floor now. Nice Russian leg sweep, and the octopus stretch is applied. What is she going to do here? Is she going to tap out? No! Able to slip underneath and deliver some blows, creating the break. She can end it here. She overcomes the pinfall attempt. Not yet. Gonna be agonizing for the arm. Oh my goodness! Kick to the spine. Oh, oh, oh. She might be in some trouble now. Morgan found the mark once again. From the top, diving center! And shoulders are down. Two gets the shoulder up. No celebrations yet. What she got here? Oh, man! What a nasty STO. Morgan showcasing her strength. Liv's resilience and grit really shining through as she takes command here. She scores big with the counter. Chops down their opponent with a kick to the knee. Building up momentum into a hurricane spot. This could do it. She kicks out with authority after two. Somehow, some way, Zelina has her measured up. Kick to the midsection. That's it. Vega just ended this. just found the strength to kick out like that. But she did. A big opportunity falling through her fingers. You've got to continue fighting and hope your next big move is the last one. She's trying so desperately to get back up to her feet. Whoa. Don't do it. Somersault plancha to the floor. Risking it all and able to connect like a homing missile. Whoa. Dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. She is at this point. And Morgan saves herself. And gets tossed back into the mat. seen it before, this loss isn't going to keep Liv Morgan down for long. Yeah, if anything, this is only going to fire her up even more.